What's up guys? It is August 11th, 2011. It's like almost one o'clock here. And so pretty, pretty much woke up like two hours ago and I went downstairs and it was like Christmas in July for me, even though it's August. I know, okay, calm down. But anyways, I got a package today and you guys need to see what it is, okay? Check that bad boy out. Mm-hmm. Straight up Master Sword. Oh, yeah. Look at that bad boy. That's crazy. Just take it all in. Just I, I know you're, like, breathless right now. Just take it all in. Look at that. Look at the craftsmanship on that. That's crazy. That is not a real jewel. As much as I... As much as I wanted it to be, seeing how we're in a recession and stuff, it's it's not real. I don't know what you want me to do about it. It's it's, it's the most real looking fake jewel I've ever seen. But I mean, still. So I mean, look at that. Look at that. I can't tell yet if this is metal. I'm pretty sure it is because if it's plastic, it's the most metal looking plastic I've ever seen. Um, it feels, you know, it feels. I don't know if you guys can hear that. It it feels like metal. Uh, this is all rubberized for grip you know and I've held this thing you know I've tried swinging this thing and I'll tell you what this is like this is like super heavy it's it's straight up metal it's it's real it's, it's about as real as you get right there the only thing is that the blade I don't know if you guys can see that it's not sharpened it is um, probably one of the only uh, unsharpened master sword replicas you can get um, but I went for more display than actual realism. Um, but, I mean, just look at that, man. Look at the craftsmanship. They engraved the Triforce emblem all the way around. Someone did that by hand. That's crazy. That would take so much time. Another important thing is they engraved it. On the, I know you guys can't really feel that, so I don't even know why I'm doing that. But this is really engraved in the blade. It's not painted on, uh, and it is painted on both sides. That is not China. That is not made in China. Well, hold on. God damn it. It does say China. Ah, I'm probably going to get lead poisoning now. But anyways, uh, it just says... Um, what the what grade of steel the blade is and it is uh, 440 stainless so this blade will never rust I could go you know I could go throw this baby in the lake right out there let it sit in the sun all day it would never rust so this is freaking awesome the only thing I'm not happy about um, is the packaging uh, a little bit of packaging like glue or whatever it is, kind of scuffed the blade a little bit, but my dad's got some glue gone stuff. So it, uh, yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty excited about this. This is so awesome. Uh, I am gonna get some paint. I'm gonna paint this uh, so it's the color that it is in the game. I'll probably upload a picture, another video after I finish that this weekend. But dude, this thing is freaking bad, man. It's so heavy. I can't even swing it right now. It's it's crazy. They lied. It is not three and a half pounds. <laughs> it's uh, this over here. They gave me a nice little display pack thing. So it's got the the crest on it and stuff. These holes are for to screw the screw the mounts in, and I'm gonna hang it right up there next to Link, my man, being chill over there. So yeah, man, this is straight up crazy, yo. It's oh my god, it's so awesome. So, just look at that, man. That is freaking awesome. So, anyways, I just want to show you guys that. I know you guys are like, man, this guy's a nerd. But I don't really care. Because that is like the best $60 I've ever spent. So, I right, man. You keep it real, gas crazy. I'll see you guys later. I don't know what that was. This is a real outro. I'll right, catch you later.